Good afternoon, everybody. Today's Wednesday, the 22nd of April, 2020. Just continuing with the project here to get these antennas up. So right there is the mount I created for the um, scanner antenna. Scanner antenna mast I just completed today. I'll give you a quick look at this guy. I'm not 100% happy with it yet, but uh, it's kind of like a test. So it's basically two inch and a half uh, by 10 foot long ENT um, pipes bolted together and then I used some JB Weld. If you've never used JB Weld before, I used JB Weld on both sides to really make that joint a little stronger than it would be with just these stupid screws. So it ends up being 20 feet long as a mast and like I said, an inch and a half diameter. Uh, usually uses conduit for uh, electrical wiring and whatnot. So now I'm going to put the antenna, the actual antenna mounted on the end of it there and get it up into that mountain. See how she looks. All right, got the antenna installed. If you're curious, it is a Italian-made Serio SD2000N. Uh, Discone type. You can see, I think I may have covered before. It is optimized for digital and analog scanners. So it's a broad spectrum broadband uh, VHF UHF antenna with uh, that distinctive kind of cone shape there, disc cone, the lateral arms on it, and it's actually got a transmission node on top, which I probably won't use because I don't plan on transmitting from this antenna, but so be it, at least it's there. So I got the antenna on it. I'm using uh, some really, really robust antenna coax. This is a uh, you, may, you may or may not be familiar with LMR 400, which has got the best 50 ohm performance, so it doesn't lose a lot of signal. And you pay a little bit more for it. This is by a company named Wilson. So it's 40 feet of LMR 400 cable all the way down this 20 foot section, coiled. And I'm ready to get this thing up into the, uh, the mount up there, but I need to lock these dogs up and get my safety gear on because I'll be standing up on top of the, well, I won't be on top of the ladder this time, but. So let me get some gear put on and we'll get this bad boy installed. Whoop, looking forward to getting this thing up there. I'm so tired of spending days on ladders. <laughs> Anywho, here's me uh, installing the antenna mast into the mount that I had uh, created. Uh, note, please, that I'm wearing all that uh, fall arresting gear. Uh, that's one of the first things I attached when I created this whole thing was a hook up there that I put my harness into. That right there, you can see it. So we're being safe, but we got that damn thing up finally, so on we go. Right. So we got the, uh, got the antenna up. <laughs> I had to just kind of laugh. So it was like 20 feet up. I mean, that was, as you saw in the video, that was a pain in the butt. Um, but all that, so that's, again, my scanner antenna. So all this co go ahead. See, actually it works. 1542, mileage is 7 zero. Five zero zero. Have a good evening. Two four three twenty. So this is a uh, Unidin BCD Bearcat three ninety six XT scanner. As you can see, it's scanning through. Breathing, liver failure, small shortness of breath, swelled up, negative screen. It's scanning all the. It's uh, programmed to scan. I forget how many. I want to say a couple hundred different um, uh, dispatchers. Drug passing on 1 again, 1411 North MC 49, 1411 North MC 49, cross you to Manly Trail, Simpson Road. Same as going to be an unwanted guest, about three individuals in the area. Anywho, so you, you get the gist. All that antenna just to drive this thing that's smaller than my hand. It's actually tiny. <laughs> the Spanish figure. But again, uh, literally hundreds of analog and digital she advised she was in a vehicle. police, um, EMS, fire departments, local sheriffs, federal yeah, agencies. Possibly across from family dollar. Doesn't matter. We can listen to them all. Yay. 